pretty small, I would say. A little memorabilia from nursing school watching over here. Here is my closet, and it's a big mirror to make me feel really Welcome back to another video. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Jasmine and welcome to my channel. I make all kinds of lifestyle videos. Don't forget to follow me on my social media at Jasmineers on my Instagram and then my Snapchat which I've been posting more frequently on is Jasmine underscore manatee. So in today's video I wanted to get into the fall spirit and I did a little bit of decorating and I wanted to show you guys around. I know that I show my room in a lot of different vlogs but I never really go into depth as far as my decor and my layout so any of the items I will link down below without further ado let's just get into the room tour so here's gonna be an overview of my room it's pretty small I would say um, but I make use of the space so I think We'll start maybe like over in this corner. So this portion right here, so this is the entry door, and then over here is the bathroom door. I don't know why there are two different types of doors, to be honest with you. Um, but in here is my closet, and it's a big mirror to make the room look bigger than it actually is. Um, I won't go into depth with my closet because, to be honest with you, I have not cleaned it and there's a lot of junk in there, so we're not going to go into that. But it is a big mirror, so it's really nice to do like outfits of the day, to check out what I look like, and I just really like the aesthetic of it. So, this big contraption over here is a little bit messy, I'm not going to lie. Um, this is where I keep all my junk. It's just a Calvin Klein bag that I use because it was all white and I feel like it matches with the aesthetic of everything. I've gotten this, I believe I got this J from Marshalls. And there's this little thing that actually says something but I didn't like the, what it said anymore. I forgot what it even says, let's see. Be awesome today, yeah. I bought that when I was like 18 so I don't like it anymore. So now it's just a little stand for the J. And then behind this, I'm sure a lot of you are probably very curious to see, um, is my little memorabilia from nursing school. So my like President's Award, my sashes, tassels, um, some things from clinical, um, my very last clinical rotation, and my 2019 tassel. There's really not much to be honest with you other uh, than my program that I was in. I cut out the uniform. If you want to see how I made that, I think it was in my... Um, it's either the photo shoot video or... Yeah, I believe it's a photo shoot video. I'm going to link that as well. Um, so this is actually from one of the my little path, pothos tree and I just tried to like make it grow. I am not sure if it's actually growing. It kind of looks like it from the bottom because it's like sprouting, but it's still not dead, so I guess it still is growing. This little plant right here, both of these are from Ikea. They're really cheap, and I have very few actually real plants in here, and I have lots of fake ones from Ikea, so this will never die on me. <laughs> so down here, we have my little book stand more so my etc pile so i have this cactus this is from target and this little book case stand thing is also from target it was on sale when i got it i don't know if it's still in stock but i think it fits really well and like you can stick something in here and make it look very cute these are all the books that i've either read or plan on reading um this book I believe it's on my Amazon storefront. 10 out of 10 recommend if you have, um, if you're in nursing school or if you even um, have graduated because that book really, um, really inspired me. Oops, oh my gosh. 
another book that I really enjoyed was The Defining Decade. 10 out of 10 recommend that if you're in your 20s or even below or above, you know. Love that book. This book, I read half of it and I no longer, I don't know, I just never really got into it. And then also this book is Anaconda. So much I want to tell you. Starbucks mugs that me and Alex collect. Um, this is just propping up this. I think I might actually take this down and put the camera here because I feel like it doesn't look as leveled. But this camera is actually a working Polaroid. Um, it's super dusty because I never use it. But I got it for a dollar at a garage sale and it's actually worth like 50 bucks now. But I would never sell it because I think it's really cute. Another candle that I have from Target. Um, I have no idea how to store my glasses and my sunglasses, so they're just sitting right here. So they're like in reach whenever I need them. You might think that this is super off-centered, but from up here, it looks like normal. But it just says, go whole heart, and this is from Marshalls. And you can kind of just change it up whenever you feel like it. But that's what I used to have in my bio for my Instagram for the longest time. And it's the lyrics to Griffin's song. If you haven't heard that song, 10 out of 10 recommend. These are two more plants from Target. I don't really know how I feel about how, the, how they look, but they're just kind of sitting there. Um, this is my etc. jewelry case that I probably should fix because it doesn't look the cutest. But this, I believe, is also from Ross or Marshalls. And I have just so much jewelry in there and I should probably get a better organization for it. I put this fall leaves here just to kind of, you know, change it up a little bit. And I think it looks cute. This is more my like etc. pile, this record player Alex got for me, I believe it was from Amazon. Um, another fake plant from probably Marshalls. I have some random cereal bars over there in case I starve death. Coming over here, this is a worker basket that I got from Home Goods. And I just keep a bunch of different like cozy blankets here. And I'm not really sure where these two are from. I believe they're from Target, but I'm not 100% sure. Coming over here, I have my blackout curtains. They're from Amazon. These are the best. And they really make my room super dark because as you can see right now, it's super bright because of the white walls. And I feel like this really balances it out and helps me sleep way better. So I have a big window over here, coming down towards the bed area. My bed is actually just a um, box underneath it and then the mattress. So it doesn't actually have a bed frame. And I feel like that conserves a lot of space. So coming over here, these white sheets, I believe they're from Target. This blanket I was debating about for the longest time, it's also from Target. And I actually just got this the other day. And normally I don't do yellow in my room, but it's actually looking really cute in fall aesthetic vibes. So I'm feeling that. This area is a little bit cluttered. I have this giant white box that has a bunch of junk in there. Um, and then I have like a lot of different like health stuff and my camera battery, etc. in there. I have this starry lamp in the corner that we used. Um, whenever we do like um, EDM events at home. And then this lamp over here is from so long ago from Marshalls, I believe. And it's a Himalayan salt lamp, but I just, I heard a lot of good things about it. I don't really know exactly what it does, but I really, really like it. This planter thing I actually just got from Walmart, which is insane. This is like the cutest vase ever. It was like 20 bucks from Walmart. Who would have thought? Um, this one, I feel like I want to take the green out. This is also from Walmart, but I really like... This actually even smells, which is weird because I thought it was just fake plants. I don't know if they sprayed something in it, but I really, really like it. And then I have these little string lights that I got from Target, and I just strung on these um, leaves just to give it more fall aesthetic vibes. So coming down here is my nightstand. Um, I keep lots of different things. This is something that a company sent me. It was um, Manta Sleep, and I never thought that I'd actually use it, but I use it 
like almost every day so 10 out of 10 recommend getting one of these eye masks because it really helps me sleep um, down here I have my charger and my Apple watch charging as well as my um, fan remote I keep some water down here because I'm always thirsty the book I'm reading right now is the China rich girlfriend this is um the sequel of Crazy Rich Asians and I just couldn't wait for the movie to come out so I really wanted to start reading the next part and then I have like aromatherapy here some more aromatherapy my vitamins some lotion and then like my face mask down here lots of etc things I have this wireless charger apparently some people are trying to contact me <laughs> um, I got that from Amazon and um, to be honest with you, the reason why I got it was because the port down here isn't working. So that's that. I got this really freaking cute ghost from Walmart for like $2. And you're supposed to put your candles in it, but I put my hair ties in it because, I don't know, I'm a girl. Um, this really cute vase and plant thing is also from Home Goods, and my friend just went shopping there the other day and I thought it looked really cute so I have one here and then I also have one on my desk this lamp right here is also from Target I am a big fan of Target as you can tell um, and I like it because it's like you just touch it and it turns on and off coming over to this neck over here I have this rug that is from um, Target also and my pillow and blanket in case I want to like cuddle up here and read which I never do anymore um, are also I think I got that as gift but the blanket is from Target and then the wicker basket um, is also from Target oh my god I have a shopping problem <laughs> at Target so that's that area coming up here we can see my one of my only live plants that I have, which is a pothos, um, and it's hanging from here. I really wanted it to be two different lengths, so it actually came in a pack of three from Amazon, and I just hung this one and doubled it up to make it a little bit longer. And then this tin can is from, I believe, Home Goods as well. And then this is my fake plant that's hanging here. Um, the the plant itself is from Ikea. This one is also from Ikea and then, like I said, the hanging parts are really cheap and they're from Amazon. I have my license up there, I don't really want to get into that. And then I have this little um, mirror that I got from the dollar section at Target and I think it's really cute. Like I said, this is a door to the bathroom and then we come over here and this is my little um, humble abode of a desk. So like I said, I have these plants from Home Goods, and I actually just split up this plant with that one, and that's how I have two of them. I have a bunch of candles. Shout out to my friend who always makes me candles. I have the pumpkin chai light, lit, lit, litten, no. Anyway, my pumpkin chai is on right now. And then this one is from Target. I have some emergency. I don't know why that's there. I like to take my vitamins all the time to stay healthy since it's flu slash COVID season. These are two books that I am reading right now as well. This is a critical care one that I actually got for free at school a long time ago. And then I bought this one actually just a as a coffee book and I still haven't read it. So I'm trying to read that. I have this little wooden stand thing, also from Target, dollar section I believe. Actually no, scratch that, that's from Daiso. I think it was like $1.50, really really cheap. And then my two candles are on top of there. I have a post-it note for whenever I need to write to-do list. So start something new is from the Target dollar section as well. Moving over here, I got this calendar and I kind of designed it a little bit and added some pumpkins some little ghost but it usually just comes plain um, and I just wrote my work days and other etc things I actually have my jewelry hidden behind here because I don't have any place to put it like I said um, sometimes I'll write on here if I have any outstanding things to do 
I used to be a cast member at Disneyland, that's why I have this little name tag. And then I am an annual pass holder for whenever that ends up opening up again. Rumor is that it's going to be announced tomorrow when it's going to reopen, but we have no idea. Coming up here, this thing is a little bit uneven, just ignore that. But this um, bookshelf is from Target. These three plants, so this plant is from Ikea, all the pots are from Ikea. But these two plants are actually from a local nursery that me and my friend had went into because she's really into plants now. And I think they're just really cute. Like, it's a little cactus. And then I don't really know what this is. It's some sort of succulent. And then these two I've had for a long time. And they were only a dollar, so really, really cheap. Coming down here again, I just have my little hanging area for whenever I need to grab my mask and my bag, so that's why that's there. And I have a little water over there because you always need to drink water. It's super, super important. I know a lot of people don't like to stay hydrated, but you know, I know water isn't the best tasting, but you can always throw some lemons or some other fruit in there to make it taste better. Um, my laptop and then the stand also from Amazon. I used to always get questions about this whenever I used to be in school. And then this lamp I spray painted black because it used to be blue. And we're not going to get a close up view of it because it's kind of ghetto. Um, my desk itself I got from a garage sale. I have no idea where it's from. My dad also got me this um, chair from a garage sale. And I have a little trash can that's from Costco. I think that's pretty much it. Oh, that rug is also from Ikea and I feel like this really pulls together a lot of the room. Makes it seem a little less bare. But yeah, that is pretty much my room, everyone. Um, I've never really done any fall time videos and that's gonna be that. So I hope you guys enjoyed my room tour for fall time and I hope it inspires you to get into the fall spirit and the Halloween spirit because I know Halloween's gonna look a little bit different this year. The holidays are gonna look really, really different this year. But I hope this inspires you to stay in the spirit and it gave you some inspiration for your own little nook area. And that is gonna be it for this video. Um, don't forget to follow me on my social media at Jazz the Nurse, and I will see you guys in the next video.